from where I come from, we have a kettle sitting on our gas stove throughout the day. We're just sitting all day and we're talking. People are changing. Some of them are constant. <laughs> Most people are changing, going, coming, you know. Fathers and uncles and all are going, coming, but there's always tea, snacks and gossips. <laughs> <laughs> In SM we call this lalsa, sa is chai, lalsa is like red tea, we say lalsa or lal pani like red water. Yeah. What has stayed I think with us culturally is the fact that come rain or shine, happiness or sadness, morning, noon or night, we are going to drink tea. <laughs> yeah. Even like fishing, like you know, at the end of the fishing day, we used to, as a crew, get together and have a beer. Mm. You know, working the way we do, we mm. wanted to, you know, socialize outside yeah. of fishing. fishing yeah. And so we started drinking tea at night. Oh, wow. Yeah, and so we, it, would, it became our own little ritual. And oh, it nice. would be me and the guys, you know, we'd eat dinner and then one of us would be up top already in the, the wheelhouse, just, you know, either trying to get cell phone service or reading a book and somebody would just, bring up the teacups. <laughs> it definitely became like a nice thing that we all looked forward to. You know, if one of us would go straight to bed, it would be like, the next morning it would be kind of a big deal. We're like, we didn't see you for tea. tea. <laughs> <laughs> How nice. <laughs> tea <Tiamo. laughs> Perfect.